Assalamualaikum. Welcome to the online classes of Sufa English School. Now, from today, we will start second lesson of history, that is sources of history. So let's start. Now, there are some objects from olden time that still exist, which our grandparents must kept. Now, whatever inscription we got from this. we can understand the history so if you want to know from any past of any past event of any document of any object you can check from any customs or traditions by reading some old books or folk arts folk literature or any of the old documents so all these are the sources of history so now there are three types of sources of history one is material source written source and oral source can you tell structures such as fort rock cut cave stupa etc are known as material source of history try to guess what other structure can be called material source now forts like any old forts rock cut caves means it an architecture is the creation of the structure of the building and the sculpture by the excavation solid rock where it naturally occurs now rock cut architecture is designed made by man from start to the finish stupa is a dome shaped building architect as a buddhist shrine so these are all the natural material sources 